What's up guys, Alex here, and welcome back to another video. Today, we're looking at the Packed One Minimalist Travel Bag. We're gonna unbox it, review it, and I'll let you know if this bag is right for you. Let's get right into it. So let's get into this unboxing, but before we do, a little bit about this company. So they did send this bag out for me to look at for my honest thoughts, opinions, and review. I haven't unboxed it yet because I wanted to do that with you. Uh, part of that is because this company is actually really interesting. I've been trying to be a little bit more subjective about the companies that I get products from or videos that I make and these guys came through and I looked up their stuff and it's awesome. They have plastic free packaging, they have an incredible, incredible design, there's no branding on the outside of it, everything was really well thought out, it's perfect if you wanna travel, it's got lots of pockets, compartments, it's easy to access all of your stuff, things were designed with thought and care on this one. It's a really cool product, so let's not waste any time and get right into it. All right, then, open it up. All right, so open it right up here. Got some really cool artwork. And then we have the bag itself. So I went with the black one. There's a blue one and a gray one, but when I travel, I like to not stand out. I do really like the look of the gray one. It was a hard toss up, but getting the black one in, I'm really, really digging this thing. So it's kind of like a duffel bag, but it is way, way more convenient. All right, so the big way to get into it is through the middle zipper, which if you take this guy right here, open it up, you have the inside itself, which is actually really cool. Got some paperwork here. So did you notice your bag didn't use any plastic packaging? This is about all that good stuff, trying to keep things environmentally safe. I'm all about that. A nice, very cool, clean looking instruction book here. Got some information, oh no. It's actually a travel journal and some information. That's awesome. So thanks, Bax. All right, into the main compartment itself. So this center spot is for your laptop. As you open it up, there's plenty of room for any size laptop. There's a little padding on each side, so that's awesome. And then on the other side of it, as you can see right here, you've got a nice space where you can kind of keep everything clean. And the reason you want this little mesh zipper space is to keep everything nice and sorted so when you're traveling you're good to go it also comes with this again no plastic some paper here this awesome very holy cow super padded uh little shoulder strap that's awesome the metal here is really solid so that's gonna be great if you're traveling and you do fill this up which you can fill it up with a ton of stuff this is gonna be really nice it's like a memory foam uh Really cool, way better than anything I've ever had. So love that. Uh, also looks like you've got kind of a tote bag here. Uh, maybe if you had like dirty laundry or something that you wanted to kind of separate, maybe shoes, this would be perfect for that. So as you pack, certain things that you don't want touching the other parts of your bag are gonna be able to be separated. For me personally, I'll probably use this for either, like I said, shoes or some dirty laundry, but awesome little inclusion. At the back of this side, you also have Again, more pockets. And even on the inside here, you have these mesh little pockets on both sides of this side compartment. So if you have things like, I don't know, chargers, accessories, maybe like a trimmer for your beard, uh, or whatever else you need, you've got space for that. So that's one side. And then this middle section right here is actually really cool, because this is for the laptop. So as you pick it up here, you can see it's kind of a nice little space. You can get your laptop nice and easy. And then the other side gives you access to a mirror image of the front side. So with this, again, you've got lots of space to pack. There's plenty of room. There's those mesh pockets and another main zipper here at the back. And that's not it with all of this. You actually have this front area where you can store random little things. And what I love about this, it's a little TSA bag here. So if you've got things like passports, keys, your wallet, things that you need to get through TSA, but you have to separate from the rest of your luggage, you can put them in here, flip it out, and this is little red color they say is to help remind you that you had other items. Make sure you grab them and put them all in here. And all of this, like I said, is so crazy thought out. So in this middle area here, you have this perfect spot for your laptop, right? But when you're going through TSA, uh, there's a spot right here in the middle that when you open it up, 
So you can take your laptop out, you'll be good to go. And then on the other side here, you have two other separate zippers. This is plenty of room for lots of stuff. And even inside of these, you've got a spot for your little, maybe keys, whatever you want. And then little sub divided pockets in the middle there. So everything here is just really thought out. So uh, that's kind of it for the first impressions, but let's pack it up and see how much we can fit in this thing. That just about wraps up this bag. As you saw, there is a lot of stuff in here. There is so much smart planning that goes into here. I had room for several clothes and outfits for a few days. Easily could use this for a few days to a week as a bag with all of your necessities. Had toiletries and shoes. I had everything you could think of. My iPad was in there because that's mostly what I need for a computer right now when I'm traveling. But there was plenty of room for a larger size laptop if that's what you travel with as well. And the nice thing is, is once everything's loaded up and you zip up that main center bag uh, zipper, then you have these little top zippers to access. So if you plan out your packing really well, you have these little spaces to get in each of those side pockets uh, to get all of the supplies you could need. There's just so much thought that went into this. It's incredibly high quality. Everything feels like it's gonna last forever. Uh, I love the packaging. I love the heart of the company. I love that they're plastic free. Uh, and it's just a really great bag. It's not a cheap bag by any means. Uh, but this is a bag for those of you who travel, those of you who like something that had thought put into it, those of you who appreciate packing and minimalism as, as well as organization, this is the perfect bag for you. If you're looking for something quality that's gonna last you a long time, uh, this might be the perfect bag. At around $270, uh, give or take a little bit there, uh, this thing is gonna be something that when you get it, you're going to feel confident in using it, you're going to appreciate how it makes traveling easier, and you're gonna appreciate all the thought that went into making your storage and you're packing a way better deal. So if you're interested in this, I'll leave a link in the description below for you to go check out their website. There's a lot of great videos and a lot of great content there to see if this is the right bag for you. But thank you guys so much for watching. Hopefully you like this video. If you like the video, feel free to like it and share it with those of your friends who are minimalist or who appreciate well-designed pieces of packing equipment. Uh, thanks again so much for watching. Follow me on all the social stuff and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.